Do you know what I hate about YouTube? This shit. 87,545, 87,546, 87,549. Okay, hold up. You just missed three or four numbers there, bud. 546, 87,549. Please start from the beginning. Uh, you know what I'm gonna do today? I'm gonna sit down in front of a camera for 24 hours straight. I got nothing better to do. Let's get it done. And while I'm at it, I'm gonna film the whole thing and upload it to YouTube. 87,550. I think he's honestly just like making up the first syllables and throwing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight at the end of it. 87,000, How does this have seven million views? January 8th, this guy's made like $10,000 and people watch it. This was in my recommended tab, YouTube. Get this shit off my freaking computer screen. I don't ever want to see anything like this ever again. And it gets worse. There's one of the guy, he's not even counting. This guy, it's called sitting and smiling. <laughs> this kid has 74,000 subscribers. This video is four hours long. And all he does is sit down and cross his legs. And he smiles for four hours. Did I get a million views yet? Some of these people actually watched the whole video all the way through. The number one comment is at two hours and 36 minutes and 36 seconds is where he was robbed. And if you click it, the door opened and closed. That's it. That's all that happened. It was maybe like two or three seconds long and somebody caught it. What the f I'm done, man. I'm done. I'm throwing it in. How can I compete with this? Okay, these videos, at least they're harmless. Nobody's getting hurt, except for maybe that guy's face from smiling. I mean, oh, my face hurt after smiling for 30 seconds just now. I can't even imagine how, how much pain he must be in. But these channels, what the hell is this channel? It's a freaking channel dedicated to children's toys. There's a video with 22 million views. And what's he doing in the video? He's sticking needles into a doll's asshole. What are people doing on YouTube? Why? Like, imagine coming home with your supplies for your video. Dad gets out of the car with freaking 15 toy baby dolls. His wife and kids are sitting there going like, oh, Dad, what are you doing? Oh, don't worry, guys. Just making a YouTube video. Just gonna stick a bunch of needles in these toys, dolls, asses. Hey, guys. Guess what we're gonna do today? I've got an idea. Let's see how many coloring crayons we can fit in Jimmy's butthole. Bend over, Jimmy. We have our thumbnail picture. Yeah! Perfect! How do these videos have so... Every single one of them has like millions of views. Oh my god. Two, three million views, 16 million views, 22 million views, 84 million... What the... F what is going on? How is this possible? Who is watching this? My brain is shutting down. Like my brain is not even competing. My brain is not even computing this shit. Look at this one. Princess Rapunzel's baby versus syringe with blue Spider-Man, Joker and Dr. Spider-Man in real life. 28 million views. <laughs> Just like pissed 
six liters of milk onto this Spider-Man's face. Yeah, I don't even know what it is. Puke and pee, just inject liquids all over to my face. I love it. And they got these kid sounds going on in the background. Ew. <laughs> 28 million people watched this video. My faith in humanity. <laughs> Shake your, shake your hand. No, Spider-Man, you were enjoying that entire thing. Yeah. He enjoyed every second of that. Shaking his head no at the baby. Joker just comes and snipes this little baby. And it pisses all over his face too. Okay, I get, <sighs> no I don't, I don't get it, like I just straight up don't, this is just weird, it's kind of demented, kind of messed up, this is disgusting, they got this baby doll laying face down with like shit smeared all over its ass, I'm done, I'm done. fun at this but seriously it it really bothers me when I see these videos in the trending tab and the recommended tab who the hell is watching these videos and the last thing that has really been bothering me about YouTube lately is the amount of clickbait and the thumbnails people put on their videos people put excuse me I gotta just man people literally Photoshop pictures of women that are not even in the video wearing provocative clothing into their thumbnail to get people to click on their video. Mike, why would you click it then? Why would you click the picture with the beautiful woman? Charles? Don't lie, you've all freaking clicked on the videos too. And YouTube does nothing about this. You can just straight up lie. I can call my video, Mike Rants and PewDiePie go to the mall and put a thumbnail of PewDiePie photoshopped into me at the mall and the video can be me sitting in a chair smiling for four hours. And YouTube will not do anything about it. And the, and the worst part about it all is YouTube promotes these videos. It, they all make it into the freaking recommended tab, the trending tab, recommended for you, recommended for me. What do you think I like watching kid needle porn? No thanks YouTube. I'm good. I'll take a hard pass on that. Get that shit out of my recommended tab. I don't know why it would ever even be there. Or some asshole counting to 100,000. No. If 
If I wanted to waste that much of my own time, I would literally cut off and go jump in the snowbank. <laughs> Anyways guys, I just felt like ranting about this. I've been working on my YouTube channel for four months now, trying to release a video at least every week, and I and I put a lot of effort into my videos, and there's no way on earth they're ever gonna get into the recommended tabs or anything like that. With the way that shit's going right now. The recommended tabs clogged up with needle syringe baby bottom and out of shape man decides to waste 24 hours of everybody's life counting on camera. <sighs> I don't know what the answer is. I think YouTube should honestly put an option underneath every video to report the video and if enough people report it for the same thing then it gets investigated by YouTube or by a mod. Even a user mod, I don't care. You shouldn't be able to just make your title and thumbnail anything you want and lure millions of people into clicking on it even though the content is complete garbage and no one stays, they still get paid. All you have to do is click the video. You really think that people sat down and watched this guy count for 24 hours straight? There's maybe a few weirdos out there that did, but most people were like, no way, this guy didn't actually count to 100,000 in a video. Oh shit, it's 24 hours long. Click. Oh, holy shit, he actually did, look. Click a couple times in the middle of the video, she's still counting. Wow, that's retarded, what a waste of time. Click away and the guy gets paid $10,000 for that video in less than a month. That didn't take any skill, that did not take any sort of creativity, that did not take any sort of, and it's not unique. Ah, just, <laughs> you know what? All that aside, I've had a lot of really encouraging friends of mine lately uh, tell me that my content's really good, they're enjoying watching it, it makes them laugh and they look forward to my videos. So thank you guys so much for that. That's what I do this for you guys. I just super enjoy doing it. Why am I doing it right now? Why am I making this video? Because it had a rant on mine and I just like making it into a funny video because then I can share it with some other people. Uh, this is just my opinion. I know a lot of people think, oh, you should be able to get away with whatever you want because the media does it and social media and all that stuff and the news all clickbait and put their titles as whatever. But honestly, I think you should have to at least have something to do with the video. It's just deceiving and, it, and I don't appreciate being lied to over and over again. If I click on some hot girl, I want to see some hot girl, damn it, YouTube. What did you say, Mike? Nothing, Charles. I said I wanted to not curl. My hair! Oh boy. This has just been Mike Rants. All the things that I hate about YouTube as of right now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hope you guys laughed a little bit. It's been a blast, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!